just film this it ends up being seven minutes long nobody wants to watch seven minute introduction to a video long story short had covid back in november 2020 literally knocked me off my feet for the best part of a month no idea why it had it in for me so bad but it did but it was fine because i didn't have my degree to do and as miserable as it was i could kind of just sit and do nothing all day long time ago now roll back round to march 2020 no february 2022 and it's got me again omicron got me fair enough honestly it's everywhere and like everyone has it in oxford at the moment probably caught it at the diwali ball which i went to on friday hence the henna um tested positive monday when i got back from a weekend with my family who all very fortunately are still testing negative and um, they did have it quite recently so i think they've already had omicron anywho um it's now thursday which i've lovingly been told by college today actually is not my fourth day of isolation it's my third because apparently monday did not count even though i was literally in isolation from 9 a.m but sure you know government regulations government regulations um still testing firmly positive uh i've been in bed for the last three days if i'm honest it actually did really floor me and i think it was a mixture of actually feeling quite sick uh which kind of sucked and like for me with covid i always just get the brain fog the brain fog is the bit that gets me i don't know if anybody else gets this when they get covid like i can deal with the headaches i can deal with the cough i can deal with that it's the fact that i actually just can't think straight um monday tuesday wednesday i did well monday I did nothing tuesday wednesday i did try today not gonna lie, I've got a lot going on in my personal life. It's just a lot of very unfortunate circumstances that basically all parted on top of me and I just had a bit of a bad day and I just honestly have just been crying on and off and since about 10 o'clock this morning, but that's fine. It's done now, it's now 7.42 um, and I just decided that I'm kind of over feeling sorry for myself. I'm here until at least Sunday in isolation um two other people on my floor are in isolation and two of them are actually not here this weekend um and so there's not really anybody about uh i am gonna have to be pretty self-sufficient hopefully they will bring me some food so i don't starve to death you know um but i basically have got me and myself and i i'm missing liv's birthday very unfortunately i had lots of very nice plans this weekend but hey it's done now we're over it we're not really over it but we're over it for the for the purposes of this introduction to this vlog and i decided I'm feeling incredibly lonely um, and it's quite a rubbish situation so I thought I'd vlog it because I was not going to vlog the three days that I spent in bed and I was not going to vlog today but then I thought you know what I have got a lot of work to do this weekend I had to put, postpone a couple of like things basically that I was supposed to do this week because honestly Monday Tuesday I was not I was not I was not and obviously the tutors were very understanding because they know that you know you can still get sick with covid i just can't believe i got sick with it a second time i really thought the booster would would help me out here and i'm sure it has helped me out loads but like still anyway i've decided that i need to get some work done this weekend i know that this is not gonna be the most exciting video for a lot of you but i also think it'd be kind of fun because ultimately i've got to get the work done and you guys tend to like watching study with me's and you say that i don't do enough study with me's so this is kind of like a study with me because i'm not going anywhere else and i will just be working basically the whole weekend because i need to make up for the start of the week and equally i want to make sure that i have free time next week to like actually go out and socialize and exist as a normal human being rather than sitting staring outside the out, out this window at the chapel like i have been for the last week so yeah basically this video is to help me not be depressingly lonely because i can talk to you guys and to help me get some work done and to help you get some work done or to just chill while you're watching your dinner you can watch this anyway um sorry this is such a frenetic intro i have randomly got like a burst of energy and i kind of just wanted to start the vlog now can't guarantee there won't be some crying can't guarantee there won't be also i'm, I'm aware i'm changing color it's because i've got like a light that changes color in front of me here i'm not just randomly changing color and i'm aware that i don't look my best right now but we're just gonna brush past that because this is literally the best i've looked in about four days um but we're just gonna have a nice wholesome vlog of me in isolation getting some work done while nobody is around this weekend and i just thought it'd be fun to do so without further ado this introduction is still quite long but i figured that the context was kind of needed i am okay it's obviously rubbish like it's a rubbish situation but it's a situation that so many people are in right now and like it is what it is and i thought i'd make the best out of it by filming a vlog at least um but i'm sorry if you know it's a bit of an emotional roller coaster it probably will be but it'll make for a fun video and a nice study with me so anyway tonight i'm doing some neo-stoicism seminar lectures for a seminar that i might actually not be out of isolation for i can be out from sunday if i test negative on saturday and sunday but i don't think that will happen so it might be that they have to patch me in via teams but i find it interesting i thought because i've had a bit of a rough day i'd go for work that i find kind of interesting tonight so plan is to write my notes on neo-stoicism when i finally stop talking put my vocab on quizlet 
and come up with my first essay proposal for my big essay portfolio which is due at the end of term um and that's basically it for tonight and if i can get that done i'll be pretty happy so let's do it sorry for the really long intro but it was needed okay <laughs> Basically how I tend to do it is like I just write this in here as I'm going so it's a bit of a state but like if I hear a word that I don't know I write it down and I've got all of this for German that I need to add in and then all of this for Spanish. I don't know if I've done this page as well. I bloody well, I think I have. I think I have. So we're going to go for these and these and it's worth writing them up because then when it gets to exams I have them all on here and honestly vocab is just like so the key for the translation exams like it's so the key at this point so yeah this will help future Eve a lot. <laughs> I honestly like it's definitely gonna be a bit more difficult this weekend now that most people are away because obviously like people in my in my flat are like willing to help but obviously then when you kind of want to eat or drink like no one's around so I think like as a flat we've kind of agreed that if no one's in the kitchen like we can go in and use the kitchen as long as we disinfect all the surfaces afterwards which I think is the college policy anyway that if you've got a shared kitchen you can still use it um, we've just been trying not to, like, obviously to minimise any chance of spreading it, but, like, girls gotta eat. Um, but, yeah, good morning, everybody. Um, I really hope my test is negative today, or at least, like, fainter. Because I thought it would be in here till Thursday. It's not filling me with much joy. I cannot lie to you. I gotta say, it's really weird because I felt really ill Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. And then yesterday, honestly, by lunchtime, I completely snapped back. Like, I feel fine today. I have no symptoms whatsoever. I'm just tired because I didn't sleep much, but I have genuinely got no symptoms. That is so bizarre, like, how quickly that, like, how strongly it comes on, but then how quickly it kind of goes. But I'm very grateful for that. Today's plan, I have a 9am class, then need to write a 500-word Spanish essay, then need to do some reading for a Golden Age seminar. And I think tonight, me and the other two quarantine patients are going to order Chinese because it's Chinese New Year formal today in college, which we we're all supposed to go to. Um, but it's just Georgia going now because like, the rest of us have got COVID. Obviously not mixing with anyone that's not got COVID, like, obviously. Um, but we, we all kind of caught it around the same time, so we're all kind of on the same stage of, like, infectiousness. So, may as well actually see people if they're sick as well, or, like, infected as well. Yeah. Oh, that is absolutely stunning. That is so much fainter than yesterday, guys. Oh my god. <laughs> One of my flatmates just bought me her spare kettle. So I'd have to go out to make up some tea. And I'm so happy right now. I'm genuinely so happy. This has made my day. <laughs> now going to do my class online. I don't know how they're gonna ring me or whatever because they're kind of all in person. So I'm just like sitting here waiting for them. Still in my PJs, I'm not gonna lie. I'll get ready afterwards. Um, but yeah. <laughs> that was super good i'm actually decided i'm gonna do a workout now i have got a fair bit of work that i need to do today but like i have not moved in a week and obviously monday tuesday wednesday and yesterday was well monday tuesday wednesday i was i just couldn't even do like existence yesterday i was just super sad so i feel like today is a good day to do some movement i don't know if you guys remember watching my lockdown vlogs from the first lockdown but back when i sort of like went to get back into fitness and stuff i did so many of the mk fit hit workout videos and i've decided i'm gonna do one today and she's uploaded like a throwback girls night one with like britney spears and rihanna and like just so many good like sort of throwback songs so i think i'm gonna do that this morning just so like i've actually moved a bit because i genuinely feel fine i've got a bit of an eye headache but like barely anything now and i think genuinely like the only thing i'm feeling now is just like 
stiffness from not having moved so really trying to like flush this out now and i've already drank one of these this morning i'm literally like pinning the water and just trying to flush it out and just trying to stay active and happy this weekend so yeah i'm gonna go and do that now ready for some hit let's do it well i probably should tie my hair up first and then ready for some hit Hey, my workout was honestly so much fun. I feel so much better now um, and I've just had a shower. So now the plan is to get dressed and start this 500 word essay. I'm going to do it on my bed guys. I'm not going to lie. Like I just want to sit on my bed and write it with some chilled music on. It needs to get done today. Um, so I'm going to try and get it done before lunch. Oh, my hair is falling out. Guys, honestly, does anyone know like this vlog is going to be so long and chatty, but does anybody know if my hair falling out more, it should be a concern. I can't decide if it's my pill, if it's the fact that I now dye my hair quite regularly, if it's the fact that I don't really eat meat anymore, I only eat fish. So I don't know if it was one of those things, but I do take vitamins, so like for vegetarians slash vegans. So not really sure what, what, what's going on with that, but yeah, let me know if you know, like if that's something I should be concerned about or whether it's just because my hair is darker, I can see it more. I don't know. Anyway, I'm gonna go and do some work now. <laughs> Lunch is toast and sweet potato and chili soup. Yum. Okay, guys, I'm not gonna lie, the work has not been going that well today. I just really can't write this essay, so I'm gonna do something else this afternoon. But look how cute this jelly cat is that I got. I've never had a jelly cat, I've literally never had one before. And I thought, you know what? Isolation is the time to do it because I've seen this one so many times, and every time I think I should really get that, it's really cute. So let me know if you've got a name for him. Super cute. I also got a massive ASOS order of like nice dresses for formals and stuff. So I'm gonna try that on now and then I'm gonna have a nap. <laughs> um, Cause I only got four or five hours sleep last night. I just couldn't sleep. Then I'm gonna try and do some work this evening and hopefully that will be slightly more productive. Everyone, so in a really annoying turn of events, I've completely crashed today, which is fine. Like, you know, it is to be expected. I am gonna try and do a little bit of work in bed, like, I was planning on doing some work this afternoon, but I really just couldn't write that essay. I think that essay is proving a bit of a stumbling block, so I'm going to leave that till tomorrow, and I'm going to try and annotate some seminar reading, so at least that that is done. Yeah, feeling a bit annoyed at myself, but equally, like, I've got the worst headache. That's definitely not a COVID headache, that's just, like, a tired headache, so maybe I overdid it when I had energy this morning, I don't know, but yeah. So work has not been that successful. I'm not gonna lie. It's just been one of them days where the day has just Did I post that to my story? Yeah Has just gone away with me So I am gonna read this now before we order a Chinese tonight Everyone is out this evening. Literally the whole flat is not here apart from me, Polly and Seb So that's the plan um, I'm gonna try and re read this now because like it's only 85 pages and I think I can probably bash this out So at least I've done something today but the work will start tomorrow properly, I promise. It just, I think I maybe got a bit excited with the workout and then have kind of ruined myself for the day. <laughs> guys so i just got back from watching harry potter I watched the half of the prince actually which i've not watched in a long time i'm not gonna lie i was just a bit out of it and tired but it was the chinese was so good made my life anyway i'm gonna go to bed now it's just gone 11 i really need to get a good night's sleep tonight because i've got to get some serious work done tomorrow so see you in the morning hello and good morning from me and my negative test <laughs> that means if I test negative tomorrow morning, I'm free tomorrow. That means I need to get some serious work done today so I can actually go out and enjoy the freedom tomorrow, but that is definitely negative. It's been half an hour. It's one line. So I'm going to finish reading this book first before I do anything else, and then I'm going to get to my desk and just power through today. And I'm feeling very motivated now finished i am now going to tidy my room and get ready for the day and start this essay the weather is honestly gorgeous today so really really grateful to have such a nice view to do some work with but yeah i'm gonna get ready now just gonna break for lunch now i actually can't get over how much just 
less dead I look with a little bit of tan on. I know my hands are a little bit gammy, but I just feel a million times better. So I'm going to break for lunch now, watch a couple of episodes of Mono Family probably. Um, just been watching like a sitcom this week because it's been nice and easy to follow and then gonna do some reading so so I just had lunch and also had like a bit of a chat with some of my flatmates like through the door which was super nice um, I am now testing negative Polly is like very close like her line is very faint so I'm very happy for her I'm hoping that she'll be out soon because she's been isolating slightly longer than me um, but yeah, so feeling good. I think we're gonna watch the rugby actually this afternoon I am gonna do that whilst working But for now, I think there's two and a half hours till the rugby So I'm gonna sit and work for the next two and a half hours I'm gonna do some reading on neo-stoicism because apparently this chapter is very helpful and it's not that long And also make a start on my presentation and yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm on a roll today So I want to keep it going <laughs> Hello, so I just finished my seminar reading. I'm now going to go through the essay that I wrote earlier, check it for mistakes, which I always suck at, and then send it off and note down the vocab that I used in it that I had to look up that was new. And then I'm gonna go watch the rugby. <laughs> everyone so it's now actually quite a lot later we watched the rugby or I, i've tried to watch the rugby and um, we had dinner they ordered pizza but i just had one of the ready meals that i had bought like the other day um and we had like a really nice long chat which was super nice i've just tested negative again so hopefully if the one in the morning at 9am is negative i am free to go which is awesome um yeah it'd be nice to leave the flat because obviously like i can kind of like move ish around the flat not really move around the flat but like i can go to polly's room um yeah so hopefully tomorrow i should be free to leave the flat which would be really good i'm now going to put on a vinyl i'm going to put on a frank sinatra vinyl and i'm going to do the first draft of this translation because i did say i wanted to do a little bit more work today and i feel like i'm kind of in the mood to do a little bit more so i'm going to put some nice music on got the window open for some fresh air let's do it Freedom! Thank God for that. Thank you, Jesus. I would like to thank everybody, my family, my friends. I'm gonna go make a cup of tea in the kitchen. Yay! Hello, everybody. So, I am now out of isolation. I have been for about three hours. And you know what I have done this morning? I've cleaned my room and I've cleaned the kitchen. I just really fancy cleaning. And I don't know why, I think it's just procrastination from work. But ironically, I don't really think I'm actually gonna go into town today. I think I'm gonna go for a walk later with Georgia. But I'm honestly just gonna work in college today. So I'm gonna end this vlog here because all I'm gonna be doing this afternoon is writing this presentation, which I really should have started this morning, but it's fine. Thank you so much for watching. Sorry it's been a bit of a roller coaster, but it turned out all right in the end. Got out on day six, which is much better than day 10. Um, and I really hope you enjoyed this weird study with me isolation chatty vlog. Let me know if you want some more study with me's as I go into exam season and let me know what videos you'd like to see from me. Don't forget to leave a comment down below, like, subscribe and I shall see you very soon with a new video. Bye guys. Mwah.